We haven't had a lot of sunshine over the last couple of days, but it has helped to keep temperatures a, a little bit more bearable, and uh, that's kind of been nice this morning. It doesn't feel too bad in most spots, but we are going to see a little more sunshine now going forward. So today, Labor Day, and much of the, uh, at least the first half of the week, skies will be brighter, and really we're not expecting much in the way of rain for the next uh, few days, and that will allow temperatures to trend hotter. That combined with more sunshine later in the week, uh, Thursday, Friday, we'll start to see the forecast getting a little more unsettled with some more moisture returning, and so that'll translate into at least the chance for a few thunderstorms. This is a live look at uh, Highway 280. I don't see one cloud on the uh, on the road, or one one cloud, one car. <laughs> One car, see, I'll just stick to the weather. Uh, but uh, it looks like things are pretty quiet, obviously, as far as the weather is concerned. No travel issues if you do have to be out and about early this morning. 70 degrees, the uh, the current temperature in Birmingham. Low 60s, Fort Payne, Gadsden, 67 in Anniston, and then some mid to upper 60s across the northern spots. Tuscaloosa, we are definitely warmer and more humid. Look at our dew point temperatures, and these are current. So it feels a lot better here in uh, East Alabama. I mean, even Birmingham, uh, 64 is, is not bad as far as how it feels outside. Once you start to get into the upper 60s, though, then it definitely gets more humid. And because of uh, that, we actually have a few spotty showers showing up on the, the radar this morning from Perry to Hale, Green Counties, even a little bit of patchy light rain there into southern sections of uh, southwest of Tuscaloosa and then up into uh, uh, Piggins County. There have been a few, but it looks like some of those are drying out, drying up as they move off to the, the north and west. So southwest Alabama, especially today, I think that's going to be the area that will have the better chance at maybe a spotty shower or two. 10% is all we're going to do, though. I think most spots rain free, a little more sunshine, and that will allow us to uh, to get to 88 degrees. And you'll notice pretty quiet and dry through the rest of at least the first half of the week and then a little better chance for some isolated or widely scattered storms toward the end of the week. So with more sunshine, drier weather, 88 to 4 today. And then look at those 90s. We're right back in them.